Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Sim Airport. We are playing on the Edge Experimental Branch and we're trying desperately to get um, people to get in and out on time. If I quickly have a look at what happened... Oh, and one thing before I continue too much is I am trying a new microphone. So please let me know how that goes. Um, the other one was kind of a little bit glitchy and things like that. So I'm trying a new one. Uh, if the quality is bad, please uh, let me know in the comments so that I can have another look at it. At the moment, it seems to be fine in terms of recording, but you guys are the boss. So tell me how it sounds like. Okay, now let's get back into things. Uh, what I wanted to check ever so quickly is yesterday's departure schedule. We're still trying to get everybody out on time. So there was one that never arrived. So I don't think we can be penalized for that. And this one again never arrived. This one was uh, late on departure quite significantly. This one never arrived. Uh, this one was fine, an hour early to be honest, and then this one never arrived. So the fact that there's so many that never arrived and then, then this one just, just was just late. But so we really had a few, we really had only one that was substantially late. Um, so maybe we are going to get there. Okay, fine. Now that's good. Uh, wow, they built that fairly quickly. So what I'm going to do... is let's quickly grab some more taxiway you you have to be kidding me this thing is causing me so much grief so let's clear I can't even see it man okay let's just demolish it can hardly see what we're doing over there yes okay fine so they're demolishing that I'm hoping that does not cause the airport to become non-secure. Um, and so what I need to do is have a quick look at the <coughs> at the plane stand. Uh, gate, gate. Let's, gate. Gate is the one. Gate is the one. Grab me. These two are the same. So they, we really don't have any room. Oh, so it's up to the edge of the building over there, of course. Okay, so we really only have room for a single piece of taxiway. Mo must be sufficiently clear of nearby obstructions. Are you kidding me? Are you saying... That... Nearby obstructions means this piece of building over here. It seems to mean that, but anyway, what we're going to do for now, we're going to just, just run that so we can test. So we can test this. Let's, uh, I'm, I'm really keen on starting to test all of this. When does this stuff get uh, delivered, guys? I think, I think there may be a delivery inbound right over here. Yeah, picking it up. Oh, yeah, inventory is back. Okay, these guys are sorting out that piece. Give me my taxiway so I can finish off that piece. Come on. What are the nearby? Oh, you gotta be kidding me, guys. Really. This, this, uh, this is crazy. Let's just get rid of all of this uh, fencing over here. So once all of this is built, hopefully, that means we can get things done. I'm, s I'm hoping that two runways will allow us to accommodate uh, the congestion a little bit more, the clumping of the stuff. This is the one aspect of this game I feel is fairly unrealistic in the sense that it... Um, in the sense that, I mean, you've got major airports in the world that operate off of one or two runways. And they've got numerous gates, terminals, and things like that. So the difference here is, if you go and look at our schedule, 
Uh, of course, we're not doing overnight, but what we also are not doing is we're not actually afforded um, arrival and departure slots or times that are uh, smaller intervals than 15 minutes. And that, I think, causes a fair bit of concern. Uh, ops panel, runways, max crosswind. Okay, so this one can't really accommodate. Okay, we'll just have both of them do everything. I know it's not... Uh, needs to be connected at both ends. We're never going to be able to do it, guy. We're never going to be able to do it because of... this. So it's never going to work. Uh, I don't like the rules that the game is now imposing, which I'm sure I didn't know about. Anyway, it's becoming daylight. Got this thing kind of accommodated over here, but still not quite working. I think all the queuing stuff... Come on, finish off this build. I don't think we're gonna get any planes on this because for some reason we need taxiway to get in on all the sides. So to be honest, if anything, can we... I don't want to dismantle the whole thing. Well, let's do it. Let's dismantle the whole thing because it's costing, going to cost us an arm and a leg to do. Um, and then what I want to do is let's uh, demolish that piece over there. Then I'm going to try and... Wow, that was quick. Probably cost me too much. To do so where is a concrete uh, runway it requires four steel for paint that's crazy okay this one I can actually do so as soon as that's removed okay fine now let's get the big planes in we won't actually get so I think that is what we're gonna do for now please rebuild it ASAP for us what is happening with our departures on time? You're on time, you're on time, you're on time, you're on time. Anybody that's gone out on time? Yes, so actual departures are on time. I'm liking it. I think we're actually getting things done. So you guys can keep working on building that. The real priority for me here is to make sure we are getting the stuff done. Uh, it's getting getting the planes out. You are an hour. You are nice, more than an hour. You're out. You're boarding, but you've still got more than two hours left. That's flight coming in. Arrived 20 minutes early. I like it. Everybody is kind of early still. <laughs> the operation is still an early one. Okay, with two hours left, you're halfway through boarding. Baggage is loaded. You are 20 minutes early. You are 13 minutes early. I like it. Everything is still early. You, my friend, are 16 minutes early. I like it. With all the planes arriving early, things are good. Now, you need to start getting out of here. You are 20 minutes early. I like it. I really like it. With everybody on time... Hopefully we can start getting, there you go. Oh man, 80 minutes early and you're out the door. I like it, I like it. Things are actually looking pretty good. Things are looking pretty good. How's these guys doing? Passengers are on the route. That's almost boarded. Excellent. That is, wow, almost two hours early. <laughs> that would never happen in reality. You are 90 minutes early. 100, 114, 130. I think, I think things are okay. Certainly no congestion on this runway to put any which way ever to speak with, speak about. Okay, you're out of the, out of here, 100% boarded, 70 minutes early, 75 minutes early. I believe you need to get out of here. And now we've got the two runways operating, to be honest, so, well, I say to be honest, so much. Okay, so active for both arrivals and departures. So at least what we're going to see... Okay, you're early, you're early. Oh, excellent. You're going to the other runway. Nice. 
Double departure. Nice. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. We've got a 51% airline interest, which is pretty good. Now, there's nothing happening over here. So, I'm assuming everything is looking spectacular as it stands. Now, you. Are you early? 20 minutes early. I think a 20 minute early arrival is pretty damn good. Nice double arrival. <laughs> I like it. I like it. 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Things are pretty good. We are pretty good with this. I think that is the issue. The fact that our departure slots and arrival, like you, you mean, at a real airport, your departure time can be 9.53, right? I mean, in this airport, we can't actually get that. You are almost 20 minutes early. Pretty good. So at th this airport, you can't actually get that. Um, you have to have like 9.15, 9.30, so that's the best you can do. And then, inevitably, that means that the runway is not busy half the time. No, not half the time, most of the time. 20 minutes. Think, I think, to be honest, our operation is really cooking. <laughs> 2.30 minutes, use an hour early, 90 minutes. Everything is looking good, guys. We are boarding. We are boarding over here. This is still disembarking, but you've got like four hours left <laughs> before you go. Nice. You're out the way. I think our operation is really smooth now. Not even close to any problems. Everything is so good. So, so good. Everything is getting out early. You still have tons of time, but you're almost ready, fully boarded. I think things are really looking good. Oh, and I did see some comments. Some of you, what is going on? Are we... Oh, no, 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 that's fine. You need one more person, and then you're out of here. Quite early, it should be. Excellent. There you go. Nice. You arrived 20 minutes early. You arrived 20 minutes early. I like it. I like it. So even that, everything is seemingly working now. People are starting to, going to start to board now. Wow, this operation is really looking good. 20 minutes early. There's a bit of a taxi from the other side, but not too bad, to be honest. Not too bad, and our congestion factor is not too crazy. I am liking it. I want to get through this day. I'm not going to do too much more. I just want to get through this day. Um, with everything kind of sorted out. What's happening on the first floor? Is everybody... So we're waiting for one or two more people. Yeah, you're on there. So where's the people for this plane and any of my other planes? Am I kind of in a... in an area where there's almost no plane supposed to be here? Yeah, because I've got them all out. Now, here comes the evening rushes, people. Uh, 90 minutes left. We're still waiting on a few more passengers, stragglers coming around. But with more than an hour left, we should get you out and very quickly. So I think we're way too efficient at the moment. We've gone from not getting those last few passengers on to... I don't know what the hell is going on now. We're 100% boarded an hour, uh, hour before the flight and we're getting you out on time. So when are we due to start seeing some flights come in? Our next arrivals is at 6. So at 5.40 we should see two arrivals. And then at uh, 5.55 we should see two arrivals. If, we, if that uh, 20 minutes early thing keeps holding. People are arriving nice and early. All my planes are out. Nobody is under big pressure to get planes out the door. We should see two planes arrive now. One here, and another one straight after, and now we should see two more come in. Okay, and one more. Nice, nice. All early arrivals, but all on the same one, though. That is also, okay, well, and that's full a full load right there. They've all come in on the same one. Wow, now it's going to get busy over here. So that's plenty of time, tons of time. Okay, these two 
these three, these three smaller planes. These big planes, they have a lot of time to get them loaded. This guy has got like two hours left and almost all passengers on board. I like the idea of that. Uh, we're out of fuel, so we do need to buy some more fuel. So let's go to the ops panel for fuel service. Um, I think what we should just do is we just do a, a daily a daily fuel buy of like, what is it, 20,000? Let's do... Uh, set a recurring order. One time. Oh, that's a one time. How do I set a, a re recurring? That's a lit liters per day at market price and buy. So I can't set a re reoccurring order, can I? 50,000. Oh, actually, is that not enough? Should we do it 100? A reoccurring order of 100,000. Uh, okay, you got... Ooh, you, 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 you. Hang on, hang on. We're waiting for one passenger. Okay, slow it down. What's going on? Whew. Okay. You're getting out. You're getting out. But this is a little bit too close for comfort, guys. And it's because you got you were gonna, I don't know, walking around, hanging on. Two hours before, two hours before. It's just this guy, but it's fine. Get out, get out. You hundred percent boarded. I'm guessing I'm I'm waiting for Some more flights to come in, am I? Yeah, so late arrivals. Nice, everybody's out. So now we're getting guys coming in. Five minutes early. Okay, so we're s starting to slowly lose that. 13 minutes early. Okay, so it's fine. As long as you all just arrive early instead of late. Seven minutes early. That's fine. We're going to have you well and truly covered on this one. And I think that may very well be the last flights for the day. The last three flights for the day. We've got all early departures. All of them. Okay, I'm very keen on getting these three out. Uh, and on time. Which should not be a problem. Yeah. So this is the first one. And it's kind of halfway loaded already. I think most people are already around waiting. Or starting to get there at least. We should get you sorted and out the door fairly quickly. Oh, that one's out. How much time does you have left? 73 minutes. This one's like 93 minutes. It's like going to be loaded soon. You need one more passenger. There you go. 100% boarded. You need a few more. Two more. One more. Excellent. 100% boarded. And I believe it's 11 p.m. We've got all of our flights out the door. Nice, nice. Now, I believe there's some kind of bonus because we've got all of our flights out on time. No, okay, let's just go through this list. I'm fairly proud of my achievement over here. Let's slow things down a tad. I know there's absolutely nothing going on at the airport at the moment. Um, all passengers, all passengers, all passengers, all passengers... Nice, nice, nice. All passengers, all passengers, all flights, and all of them on time, and and some substantially so. This ten, ten twenty, oh ten. This eleven p.m. out the door is an almost an hour earlier than it should be. Everybody has got early arrivals and early departures, and man, I'm kind of want to see what happens at the end of the day because there's supposed to be some kind of bonus that you get for that. Let's see. Is okay, hang on. What does that mean? That's just all stuff that we've paid. So how do I know if the if there's a bonus in effect? Supposedly there's some kind of bonus. I can't let's see the finance. Profit and loss. Uh cash flow graph. Fine, that's okay. Airport value, seven million, it's okay. Profits and loss. Profit and loss. Uh Where's our income? Oh, that's not uh, for yesterday. Let's see. Let's see. We should be able 
to see any bonuses in here or does the bonus only get into effect today so our income there oh, but we built a runway for crying out loud of course we've got a, a bit of a a bit of a reduction there okay so our operation is pretty good we make about a half a million a day which is pretty good um, well in this game at least um, it's pretty good um, runway fees is there anything here that's gonna say what's going on why is uh something funny with that let's uh, I want to go back to this and say profit and loss uh, for yesterday and what I want to do is I want to these don't actually expand it seems what can I do over here okay okay well let's uh, let's see how it goes we should be able to now really f finish this thing off um, add some more flights, get some standby. Um, can we do standby stuff? I'm not too sure. Anyway, what I'm going to do is let me get some gates going. Gates. Uh, the XLs. I can do a I can do a big XL at the front here, which I actually think that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to do that so that we get this kind of airport. I want to try the big boy over here. Uh, oh, it requires ground for placement. Yes, of course. Oh, yes. Yes, I'm going to... What I can do is I can build a little bit and I can move this thing out and I can build a little bit of room so that we can squeeze two of them in there all right we can squeeze two of them in there at the end if we do move this thing out a bit and maybe what we'll do is we'll move it out a little bit more so we'll move it out by two so let's start by building that and do that and okay so let me not throw it taxiway so let's do that okay once that's built we'll clear off the, that one and then we'll start building a bit of terminal space here uh, for this guy to to operate in so we can get the big boys up here again out of this stuff get me to the ops panel can I how do I okay hang on, let's just get to this one get rid of that how much fuel do I have did we fill up? Yeah, we did. So the 100,000. So we just might be not doing quite enough. Okay, so let's uh, quickly see. Commercial pricing is fine. Is there maintenance? Got maintenance running. Okay. Transport capacities. Uh, transport uh, and deliveries. Okay, hang on. Retail. Can we have not, maybe not daily restocking. But every, let's do, let's go for every four hours on this one. Garbage, let's do every 12 hours on garbage. Buses is every 30 minutes. Light trail is hourly. Maybe what we'll do is we'll go for every 30 minutes. And that's, let's say, apply those changes. So that should, I think that should get us sorted out with that. So, okay, these guys, are you guys building all of these things okay so building is underway let's speed things up a little bit get those things built I'm gonna start making room for the extra large uh, gates yeah extra large gates okay this is pretty good that side I don't know what happened why I missed the um, the spot over there but what we could do is we could actually put in a hanger over here somewhere and maybe another hanger over here somewhere because stuff's gonna be a little uh, we actually may find some room we'll see see what kind of room we have okay now let's uh, let's demolish these guys and then we got room for the uh, the extra large gates I want to get the extra large gates up and running 
But f to be honest, we really are getting things better now. So now we should have some room. I'm wondering when we get the early AM. What is required to get the early AM flight contracts? Requires the XLs. What? Runway, uh, requires runway PAPI. Requ oh, that we've got. Oh, yeah, yeah, fine. We just need the big gates. Uh, but by the way, we should probably look into upgrading these with the uh, with these lights. And I don't quite get... Okay, over there. We'll get some <laughs> PAPI lights over there. Any other upgrades? A runway ILS. Oh, runway lights. Yes, of course. So where I just do uh, this? Well, let's get the lights on there. Uh, anything else? Up oh, that's why they didn't use it. It was too dark. <laughs> Upgrade uh, runway lights. Oh, we need another one. Oh man, I don't think I've got the. I don't think this is actually going to work. I'll just do that. I know it's silly. I know you guys probably screaming. That's not how it works. I know that's not how it works. I'm just trying to get this operation to work for crying out loud. And then uh, runway ILS, which I will place. Uh, yeah, well, it'll have to be. It'll have to be somewhere over there then. Okay, flights are coming in thick and fast. 20 minutes early, 20 minutes early, 20 minutes early. I like it. I am loving it. Okay, now let me start working on the on the gates. Uh, and I want the XL gates over here. So let's uh, turn them appropriately like so. And I'm kind of thinking maybe the other form of appropriately placing them is actually over here. That that correct? Then we have a bit of a. Or should it, should I do it on that side? Maybe I'll do it on that side. Yeah, let's do that. That's going to be better. I know it's not quite symmetrical, but we'll get there nonetheless. So that's. A, B gates, this is C1, and this, well, once that's done, I'll rename it to C, and then we'll go with uh, the D gates down here, I believe. You're nice and early, nice and, uh, not that early, to be honest. Uh, nice and early. I need you guys, you haven't even started boarding yet, you re oh, you're just uh, getting people out now, so... You're almost done boarding. Now, what I need to do is I also need to start building some foundation. So on the ground floor, with in terms of foundation, what I'll be doing is I will be... Uh, shall I just do this, though? Well, let's start off by building that one. I think that's going to be... Sufficient. Nice. Getting in there. I like the simultaneous arrival. It's really cool. One fifty five, one oh five. Okay, you should be pretty much close to full. Yeah, that's fine. That's gonna be good. That's good. You're sixteen minutes early. Nice. Things are really really working quite well i am enjoying it and i'm ra really enjoying filling this up and guys oh hang on hang on hang on hang on hang on just 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 let's pause it ever so quickly wow we spent a lot of money what i want to quickly have a look at is are we okay hang on this guy's going to depart now so once this guy departs i want to see what that means for for the money uh plus 1600 I thought we get a bonus. Somehow I'm not feeling we're getting the bonus that we, we should be getting. Retail transactions. We should be getting some kind of bonus that I feel we're not getting. 70 airline interest is slightly up and so on. So guys, uh, in the next episode we will continue and look at filling out the rest of the airport. 
we are kind of getting close to the end of the series i would expect but yes we're still gonna fill up this get the big boys to come in and then fill up all of these and see if we can maintain the operation maybe we purchase some extra land get an extra runway or two in there but we will see how that goes thank you so much for joining me thank you so much for watching if you've liked it as always hit that button um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and leave me some comments down below tell me what you think have you do you have any ideas uh, and so on. Okay, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.